Hi friends, this is Anayat, and uh, it's been a while since I've had a video on YouTube. A lot of things have been happening, and uh, I've got a direction for a set of uh, next videos to put on YouTube that I think will be valuable and hopefully helpful to folks. And uh, they have to do with the theme of energy. Energy is very important. It's something that interests me a great deal, and energy is often kind of a nebulous concept. Um, you know, we know about E equals MC square. We know it's not a good idea to put your finger in a light socket. Um, we know these things about energy. We know that maybe we're using too much energy on the planet and it's better to be more energy conserving. But there are other types of energy. Energy which more has to do with consciousness. And it's these forms of energy that are not bounded by human processes, but are natural processes that I'm most interested in. And really, when you look at this, uh, energy is the basis behind existence. And I believe, as time goes on, that science will eventually have to admit that energy is consciousness. Today, science believes that consciousness is a byproduct of neurochemical function of the brain. But it's actually the other way around. The brain exists because intelligence and consciousness is looking for a physical vehicle to interact with Earth, with the body. So this theme of energy, there's really something to it and really something real that you can experience. And I think that's prime motivator for me in these videos is to give you something that you can sink your teeth into, some things you can do, places that you can go in order to have the experience for yourself. Because it's one thing to listen to somebody on YouTube or go to a talk and you know they can tell you about all these things that they know and you know what happened millions of years ago or you know with people from another star system or ancient civilizations or whatever. But uh, unless there are some principles there to help you orient yourself, and unless uh, there's some meaning that can be derived, and really a way for you to internalize the information that's being talked about, um, then those kinds of talks are just a lot of talk to me. Uh, I don't appreciate them that much. So what I want to do is to give you a, a new set of videos in order to help you and inspire you to move forward in a way uh, that you'll find meaning, more meaning, more consciousness, more awareness in your life. So uh, I'm going to leave this video with a exercise for you. And if you've never done this, it's kind of fun. If you've done it before, it's still fun. And that is rubbing your hands together. What this does is this wakes up the energy centers, the chakras in your hands, and then, like right now, I can feel kind of a tingling going back and forth. That's just not a mechanical tingling. It's an energetic interaction that's going on. And as you pull your hands apart, there's kind of a lightness to it, kind of a falling away sensation. And then as you push your hands together, this is harder because it feels like there's pressure, like there's a balloon or something. And then again, as you pull apart, it becomes more subtle. And, you know, I can still feel it. My hands are three feet apart, four feet apart, and I can still feel it going on. Uh, and this is a, an exercise you can do with two people if you want. You can rub your hands together and then hold up your hands to the other person. And then, you know, you guys just move your hands on this side, move them back, and then move them together. And then how about this side? How does that feel? So I want you to experience energy because when you experience energy, there's a change that occurs in you because energy is consciousness, and energy is information, and energy is intelligence. And anytime you move energy, you are growing, because you are energy. 
and energy wants to flow. There is no bad energy. There's only stuck energy or heavy energy. So get out there and uh, move your energy. Talk to you again soon.